What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Vontae, the first back again for another video, man. Today is a nice day. It's a nice ass Sunday, man. Attack on Titan drop, Demon Slayer drop. You know what I'm saying? My boy Clay Thompson returns to the NBA today, and look, we got a chapter from Fire Force, man. This is, hey, it's a great Sunday right now. You know what I'm saying? But um, yeah, man. Last chapter in Fire Force, Shinra is just basically showing out. Shinra Bon Showman was showing out. His design, like I said, is fire. Everybody loves, you know, I know. Every, all the discourse online, everybody loved that shit. That shit looked clean. I learned that, like, the ribbons that, like, attached to him basically says Shinro Bon Showman, like, just repeatedly. So that's pretty cool. That's a dope uh, aesthetic. But he's just showing out against Haumea. You know, he's basically just saying, hey, man, you're contradicting yourself, Haumea. This and that and that. You know what I'm saying? Being sarcastic to her, just being smart ass. You know, all of it. I love it because. Is, is well deserving you know he's trying to get through to her to understand that this shit ain't it it just ain't it but i'm excited to get into this next chapter so let me just get into it but before that let me tell you guys to please like comment subscribe share the video if you fuck with me please do so because about 80 percent of the people that watch my channel on the regular don't subscribe to me so please do so i can see it in the end of lakes i see all that shit man so please subscribe to your boy it's not like i want to be spamming your feed or nothing like that but nonetheless let's get to this next chapter chapter 297 Mankind is unconscious, becoming one with the evangelist. Oh, yeah, that's another thing. And the, the saint cries. Uh, Haumea, she's basically like transforming or she's uh, fusing with the evangelist right now. And she had like the eye that was coming up, looking like the Kishin from Soul Eater. Maybe, well, not maybe. There definitely is a connection there. But let's just see what's, what's going to happen, you know? Shedding as many tears as there are creatures born on this planet. In order to compete with Shinra Bonjo Man, Homea becomes a despair saint. That's a weird thing to say out loud. Despair saint. Oh yeah, another thing I, I um I seen recently, uh Okubo said that he has like two more chapters that he needs to draw and shit. So I don't know how many chapters we got left in general, but I know it's not that much, but he said he only has two more left. So I'm maybe like seven chapters like six to eight something like that i'm thinking probably six or seven something like that baby we'll see though you're not looking too bright there <laughs> despair saint <laughs> you see what i mean i love this this channel it's like he's being dead ass serious like he's, he's not like fucking around but at the same time he's also it seems like he's being sarcastic you know what i'm saying like he's, he's jokingly saying things but he actually really means it it's, it's interesting Shinra Bonsho Man is here, so quit crying already. Let us perish together, Shinra Bonsho Man. Another thing, and I say this every single video. I know y'all probably getting tired of me saying that. Maybe, maybe not, whatever. I'm going to say it again. It's just so interesting to see Shinra is the guy that's basically the devil. You know, he looks like the devil. And Haumea, she's basically a saint. She looks like a goddess, you know? And, but she's actually the antagonist, and Shinra is actually the, the protagonist. And if you were somebody that didn't know shit about Fire Force and you were to hop in around these chapters and seeing this shit, you're like, damn, this dude's being a dick to her. Like, what is this? Like, this devil dude is just ain't it. Why is he talking to her like this? You seeing her cry and stuff, you know what I'm saying? So I really love that by Okubo, and I say it a lot every time, but it just, every single chapter, I just have to say it because it's like, it becomes more and more apparent as I read, but still cool nonetheless. Look at that attack. Embrace these black flames. They offer you your salvation. And he just washed them fucking flames away. Oh, he changed them into goddamn flowers. So Shinra can do any fucking thing right now, boy. Brother, those sparks. Yeah, what the hell? Wait, is it like those sparks? Is that like Hibana's ability? Cause you know how like she has like the the whole thing with like, the flowers and stuff. She uses flowers as as her like um, pyro, pyrokinetic fire energy. You know what I'm saying? So I wonder if that was Hibana's. Cause like you know she does those flowers and those are flowers right there. And that's actually really good drawn flowers too. What are you turning these flames that I've waited for for so long into? How dare you? Look at that boy Shinra. Boy, oh, he finally with the flowers like around him. That's cool. Once again, revisiting in vain or resisting in vain. Shinra Bonsho kick. Damn. I think she I think she dodged them. The flower's still there though. Please stop this. Those black flames are dear to me. <laughs> he just kicking all them flames away. Boy, with that fire foot. Damn, man. Look at the art in these chapters, bro. They've been in this final arc, the art has been consistent. It has never like dropped down. And if it has, it was for reasons like, you know, just like dialogue and shit. But when it comes like just the action and anything like that, psh, 
shit, that shit is very good. Aesthetic wise, really good. Please stop this already, please. No more sorrow. Take another look. Pretty, isn't it? He created a little design with it. A light such as this can only be found in a life outside the chain of despair. Do you plan to connect me to such a life? <laughs> uh, let's see. What did what, what did that thing I said I saw at Vulcan's workshop look like? I think it was something like this. Wow! And he made a well. He look like I said he's using everybody's shit, trying to show how man like humanity is just beautiful. You see humanity as like this cruel thing, and yes, it is cruel on one side. But there's still beauty in nature, it's beauty in life in general. It's just life is beauty, no matter what, you know. Just because we go through certain things, I'm not trying to sit, like downplay it, but because we go through certain struggles and just extreme, just you know, fucked up shit all the time, there's still like the essence of what we are as human beings or whatever you are, every, whatever species, nature in nature. You're still special, no matter what. You being alive, breathing, speaking, communicating, you know, all the stuff that you do is just a beauty in itself. And he's trying to show Hamea that all these things that people invented, all these creations, all of the art, everything about Earth, and you trying to destroy all this shit, it's like, that's kind of crazy. It's like, if you if I show you something that, that appeals to your eye, and you tell me you want to destroy that, you're contradicting yourself. This this is the whole point Sharon was trying to make to Hame. It's like all this shit you live for, everybody else live for, but you talking about death is like salvation and death is like the solution to all the shit, the chaos and stuff. Yet you're trying to neglect and ignore all the beautiful shit that's in the world, and you're trying to take that away. And when you know that shit is beautiful, is it's appealing to you, but you want to take it away? You don't believe that. So I I really like his philosophy, brother. That that well just now isn't that a bit too comical? <laughs> Hey, come on. <laughs> I can't exactly, uh, I can't remember exactly what it looked like. Oh yeah, it did look kind of, it was like upside down. Or, I mean, or did it, oh no, it jumped out, but still it, it is kind of like upside down. <laughs> Sharon Boncho, man, you are a devil that continues to create sorrow. Before this wretch stain spreads any further, I must return you to the flames by myself. God damn, she shot a beam through her fucking eye? God damn. Brother, watch out. That's a divine light. That'll destroy anything it hits. You can't survive such a thing. No living being could, and he caught that shit. What amazing energy. And he just threw that shit up. Damn. They throwing suns and shit, hey, man. <laughs> it created an atmosphere. Whoa. This man's really creating the world. The black flames are being extinguished. And then you see Arthur still looking. Wow. Let's shed some tears in the rain, despair, saint. To be continued. Damn, this chapter is too quick. To be continued, chapter 298. It's God. That's what it's called. The overwhelming power of hope wipes off the tears and despair. Wow. So is he going to actually, like, I was thinking that the flames already destroyed Earth, but technically, I guess it didn't. So I wonder if he's going to, like, reconstruct Earth since he got all this power to do so, or is he going to, like, like reconstruct earth in terms of like all the people that were there, you know, when the cataclysm was happening and everything that was there, buildings, all that nature, is he going to like revert it back to normal or is he going to like create a new world from that by, you know, changing the flames and then he just starts creating people and a whole bunch of stuff. That would be interesting since he essentially is like God, him and Hamea, they're both like gods fighting against each other. So that'd be interesting. But um, man, dope chapter. Like I said, the art has been non-stop flames for me you know what i'm saying no pun intended i mean it really just is that's just what it is but um yeah man let me know down below what you guys saw about this chapter i mean it wasn't really too too much to talk about other than the shit i already talked about throughout the video and just my appreciation of the art and everything um let me know how you guys feel like we got about like i said maybe six to eight chapters left 10 max, but I don't think we're getting 10. So we got somewhere between 10 and less than that. So let me know how you guys feel about that. If you feel that there should be more, or you think there should be even less, or you think that's perfect, wherever it's at, you know? Um, but yeah, man, I hope you guys enjoy, enjoy the rest of your day. Just like I said earlier, enjoy the rest of your day, man. Stay safe, stay healthy, stay clean. See you guys on the next video. So stay tuned for all the good shit because I'm having more content for y'all. So stay tuned for that. See you guys in the next video. And peace.